Well, if you're a fashionista, then you might already know that plaid is the latest trend right now. Joining me now is Alexa Rizik from the Outlets at Anthem. She's our outlet shopping gal, and she came all dressed up herself in adorable little plaid outfit. And my plaid, yes. Very Super cute. Thank you. Yeah. Sort of an alternative way to wear a plaid. It doesn't always have to be with jeans. You kind of think like flannel shirts and yeah. stuff. So we're going to show you some ways to wear it that are a lot more fashionable. You don't have to look like a lumberjack. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Although I do like lumberjacks, I must admit. Lumberjacks right. are cute. And I have one of those flannel shirts that I put on too when the weather gets cold. I, I think we all do. It's I a think staple. we all do. And, and, and just, just FYI, um, I know that you're already interested in the plaid looks, but Stay tuned because the word of the week is coming up. See if you can guess what it is, okay? All right, we'll just tease you with that just a little bit. All right, let's take a look at your first model. She's okay. She's so super cute. So cute. Look at this outfit. It's from Rue 21, which is one of our stores out at the outlets at Anthem. And of course, we're going with the basic plaid shirt because I think everyone should have one in your wardrobe. Now this one, it's very lightweight and it has elastic around the waistline. So it gives her a really cute feminine shape. She was saying when she put it on earlier that she felt like sometimes she doesn't know if she should tuck them into jeans or if it's hanging out around your waist. Mm. So this is a cute way to wear it so that you still um, keep a really cute shape. And of course, the colored skinnies are in. I see you're wearing yes, yours yes, today, I've so you're on. right on trend. Got my pumpkins on. There you go. <laughs> um, and and she um, looks adorable in her plaid outfits that she could really take anywhere. It's just a cute, casual outfit. It's the whole head-to-toe outfit is absolutely adorable. Look at that cute little hat. I know, the hat really, it sort of is the cherry on top, literally. <laughs> You're right about that. So we were talking earlier about the fact that there is a little bit of a blurry line between the plaid and, and the checked, right? There really is. I mean, maybe plaid should have a few more colors into it. But do we really need to get that technical with our fashion? No. No. I no, think we don't if, need to define yeah, it. If it looks great, then wear it. I that's, agree. That's my philosophy I on agree. it. I <laughs> agree. And of course, plaid for the guys is always, you know, pretty popular. It I mean, is. You popular. can't go wrong. Exactly. And I know that guys love it. And I feel like guys sometimes have less options when that's it comes big, to getting dressed. That was a big dressed. sigh there. <laughs> <laughs> Frank always looks great in whatever he's wearing, um, but I really wanted to promote sort of layering because when guys think that they don't have a lot of options, maybe they always think that they have to wear t-shirts and jeans, but right. you don't. Add a few different things, and then like we say, the weather's getting cooler. You can take it off during the day if you're too warm, and then add it at night. Um, but nice little shades of the same color, like oh. here we used green, but in a few different shades. Mm -hmm. And it really comes together as a sort of fashion forward way to wear that plaid shirt. Mm -hmm. Well, and being here in Arizona, you know, it's always nice to do the layering anyway, because, mm -hmm. you know, you can start, you know, to, to unlayer, mm -hmm. I guess, <laughs> yes. as necessary. But really loving that quilted vest. It looks very um, trendy and, and handsome at the same time. It is. It's great. From Banana Republic. Great, Banana great Republic. Great okay. Yes, okay. Absolutely. Excellent. Yeah. Okay, so here's what we were talking about. Um, the little check, but it's got the plaid combo. Yeah, so this is a jacket from Guess, and we sort of did go out on a limb because I wanted to show some other pieces that just aren't your regular plaid shirt that we're talking about. So it is a little checked, but it is plaid at the same time, I think. So nice piece. You could wear this to the office. You could wear this to a party. It's a great layering piece with that pop of color underneath so that you're not just sticking to the black and whites. Um, but a really, really fun piece. It's got a satin collar on it that sort of dresses it up a little bit. I feel like you could definitely take that to a holiday party oh, over a sure. little black dress if you wanted to. You bet. Yeah, you so bet. a lot of options with this one. And because it's black and white, I mean, I mean, any pop of color will work. Oh, any pop. Yeah, you could wear pink, purple, and purple's really big this fall. I saw in the guest store next to this a bunch of purple, purple skinnies, like the pants that we were talking about earlier that are beautiful. Ooh, really? Yeah. And speaking mm -hmm. of purple, <laughs> love this. It happens to be my favorite color, so you might see it a lot when I come on. <laughs> it's mine too, <laughs> so it? it's okay. Okay, yeah. good. Um, so this look is from Lane Bryant, 
And of course, we wanted to show another version of plaid, which is a skirt. And it's a beautiful, beautiful skirt on her. And it does come in other colors. There was a sort of tan red version of this. So if you're not into maybe the bright greens and purples, there was a little a toned down version of this skirt that was just as beautiful. But I thought it was fun with the little punch of color. And once again, we did the layering with a cami underneath and a sweater over the top to sort of complement the colors in the plaid of the skirt. I love those color combinations. And it, isn't that fun? And who would yes. think like green and purple? Normally, I don't think that I would think to put that together. I, I, I know. I agree with you on yeah. that. But look how fabulous but that looks But it's working on really well. And so that is from our Lane Bryant store, which um, is having a sale. Everything will be 40% off. So if you wanted to go into the store and buy that, it would be 40% off. Now let's let's just for the folks at home who've never been to outlets at Anthem, it's 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 your all. Every store has major discounts. Major discounts. Major. It's thirty to seventy percent off regular retail prices. So if you went to a Banana Republic store in the mall and then you went to the outlets at Anthem, it's going to be thirty to seventy percent cheaper than and the same clothes, it's the same uh, items. Which yeah. is uh, which is amazing because you know. Uh, what Alexa is showing us are on trend Very fashions on trend. Absolutely. that are discounted. So, absolutely, um, hello. It's, it's a no-brainer. It is a no-brainer. <laughs> and speaking of no-brainer, the word of the week is? Well, if you haven't guessed it yet, <laughs> it is plaid. Okay, I think So that. you can say the word plaid at the customer service at Outlets at Anthem and you get a free gift. That's awesome. Yes. I like, and we do that every week. So when you when you uh, join us for the segment, uh, you have to stay tuned, and we will share that word of the week with you every single um, Thursday, so you can get uh, a free little gift. Outlets at Anthem. Where where are they? Well, they're located 15 minutes north of the Loop 101, off Interstate 17, at the Anthem Way exit, which would be 229. You can't miss it. Huge billboard out there. The address is right there on your screen, and you can reach them by phone at 623. 465-9500 or online at outletsanthem.com. And don't forget your word of the week is plaid. plaid. <laughs> <laughs>